probably caught wind of the El Camino's resurrection rumors. It felt like a done deal, just waiting on the official stamp. However, fresh intel suggests there might be another contender eyeing a return, the 2025 Chevy Avalanche. To be straight, only one thing is certain, General Motors needs a compact truck to stay in the game. With Ford unleashing the Maverick, Stellantis confirming the Ram Rampage, and Toyota dropping hints about Stout, the competition is heating up. The compact truck segment is on the rise, with whispers suggesting the El Camino might taking that spot in GM's lineup. However, the spotlight is now on the potential resurgence of the avalanche, with sources signaling at a plot twist. No, General Motors is not giving up on their our electric future is now mantra, with more EVs slated for the coming years, potentially including the truck that roared between 2001 and 2013. All right, let's dive into General Motors' electrification saga. With several models already hitting the streets and many more in the production, the ultimate goal is a fully electrified lineup within the next 5 to 10 years. EVs been hyped too much and drivers are not keen yet to invest into something new. And let's face it, everything about these electric powertrains screams pricey, from the initial sticker shock to ongoing maintenance costs. Nevertheless, market share is steadily climbing year by year. It's only a matter of time before EVs will take over. That is why it is important to consider the 2025 Chevy Avalanche as a serious concept, especially for the future. General Motors has already thrown its hat into the ring with battery-powered beasts like the Hummer and Silverado trucks. The upcoming Avalanche could either fall into the midsize or compact pickup category. To elbow their way in the realm dominated by die-hard internal combustion enthusiasts, EVs have to deliver more bang for the buck. Unfortunately, that's not the current reality, so the Avalanche needs to do something unique, and once again, affordability is key. The compact pickup spot in the lineup is still vacant, and according to insider stories, General Motors is working on the fresh model. Enthusiasts wasted no time drawing parallels with the iconic El Camino, a beloved utility vehicle from the 60s, 70s, and 80s. After its discontinuation in 1987, the car-based pickup made a cameo in the Breaking Bad movie, and now it could be poised for a triumphant return to the production line, as escape crossover-based truck. The Avalanche might throw a wrench into these plans. But, it used to be a large model, and that is why fans overseen it. General Motors produced it between 2001 and 2013, axing it in the same year as the luxury truck Cadillac Escalade ESV. It is the least likely that Chevrolet is going to use the Montana nameplate for the US market. This pickup has already been cruising South American roads and could serve as a solid foundation for developing a compact truck built for the United States and Canada. Of course, unless the Avalanche opts for an electric route, in which case, the platform might need a few tweaks. We'll monitor the situation about developments regarding GM's compact truck and electric vehicle lineup, with fingers crossed for more details on the Avalanche by the latter half of 2024. The trend of resurrecting classic nameplates is cool nowadays, just look at Chevrolet's revival of the Blazer SUV, and when it comes to trucks, both the Ford Maverick and Toyota Stout are fresh faces, albeit not entirely original nameplates in the automotive world. Plus, many of these reboots come with modernized twists, departing from their nostalgic predecessors. Stay tuned fans. We'll be back with another video the moment Chevrolet greenlights the new truck, whether it's the 2025 Avalanche or whatever name they settle on. Hit the subscribe button and be among the first to hear all the juicy details. Thanks for watching.